And uh, first of all, I'm Spiros. I have the page Reflexology World News. We're in Athens. I'm here with a new friend of mine, colleague. Her name is uh, Shimi Manor. She is uh, from Israel. And, uh, you know, she, we got together for a course here in Athens, and it's over. We just finished. And all these days, you know, there were people from all around. And it's so interesting always to know what's going on. Uh, around the world having to do with reflexology and I found this like when you were telling me some things I found them exceptionally cool fantastic news and all that and I wanted I thought it was a good opportunity Shimi to speak about reflexology in Israel so let's you know make it like an interview a friendly one if you agree and first of all you are a reflexologist obviously how many years have you been practicing like 10 years so? You're quite um, experienced. Mm -hmm. yeah. Israel is big on reflexology, yes. I believe. Of 30 years. 30 years? It That's began, let's say, 30 years. Uh, how many? Mid-80s. Mid-80s, all right. And if I would ask you how many reflexologists are practicing in Israel, how many would you say about? I think uh, more than maybe 2,000. 2,000. Yes, 2,000, something. You know, we're a small country. We're just about uh, 6 million. So Six million, yeah. two thousand reflex. So there seems like that. Yeah. So the Israelis enjoy cam therapies. They appreciate yes. them and all that. Tell me about training. How long does um, is training regulated? First thing. Regulated. It yeah. is regulated. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah, you have one year or two years or three years. You must have two years to practice in hospitals or in um, H and O community services. You know. Uh, so you must have two years. So to work uh, with the government mm -hmm. to provide for the civilians uh, treatments, you would have to have completed a two-year course. Mm -hmm. Is it a re obviously it's a regulated profession, let's say? Yes. yes, it is. All right. And uh, you mentioned in hospitals that it's offered and That's various true. other structures of the community. Yes. And uh, do you work there? Yes. Oh, yes. I, I work. Two hospitals in Tel Aviv. In Tel Aviv too. Tel Aviv. Uh, one is a public hospital and one is a private hospital. And I'm working also in the uh, HMO community service All right. uh, beside of my private uh, clinic. So, they so you work in the hospitals and you have your own private clinic yes, also? Yes, right? yeah, and also in a community yeah. service that everybody is paying for. Mm -hmm. uh, they called Maccabi. And mm -hmm. for the Maccabi, it's 20 years, you know, the... the That's it's being offered, 20 yeah, years 20 now already. Years. They celebrate 20 years. That's why I like that we, you know, for you especially to share, and for myself, because there's a language barrier with some countries. And with Israel, you know, from time to time, I read in the news nice stuff, but it's always better now that we're together, you know, you That's can true. inform us of what is actually going on. We're still uh, writing books, you know. Nowadays, the j just published a new book about reflexology. It's in Hebrew. I'm sure it will be published also in English. Another yeah, English. Yes. Who is the author of this book? Yochi Keshet. Yochi Keshet was uh, one of, uh, she's still a reflexologist. This, she's the head of the college department, uh, the reflexologist department mm -hmm. in the Cam College uh, named Rigman. And uh, she wrote about the left and right uh, brains in, uh, according to the legs also. Oh, the hemispheres uh, yes, with the legs. and the sides. Oh. Uh, yeah. mm -hmm. Cool, fantastic. Mm -hmm. Tell me something out of interest. Like, all right, it's fantastic. You're in hospital. Hey, do you get paid? I get paid. It's a paid. Uh, because, you know, in the UK, there's an army, which is good, an army of volunteers. I'm all for it. But as Spiros or my previous involvement with politics of reflexology, I want to see professional reflexologists, you know, getting decently paid for the work. So that's great news that you get paid in the private and the public hospital. That's true. Fantastic. Now, tell me, how would a doctor in a, a medical setting, what, what kind of clients do you see in the public hospital? In the public hospital, I'm inside the oncologist Division. Oncology department, all right. Yeah. Yeah, so it's only a little break. Yeah, little break, all yeah, right. Yeah. Here we are, it's alive. What can we do? It's great. Yeah, so only oncologist patients. Is this integrated medicine? Yes, yes. So they take their do they do their treatments, their chemo, yes. whatever, and yes. then you guys come in? Yes, I'm not the only one. There are also like uh, 15 
Um, therapists? therapists? Are they all reflexologists no. or other modalities? All the other modalities? What kind of modalities? Chinese, medicine, medicine you know, acupuncturist, shiatsu, shiatsu? mind therapist, mm -hmm. nutrition. You know, we need to be thinking about doing multifactorial. Yes. Very good, mm -hmm. very progressive. Mm -hmm. So you said mentioned oncology. Mm -hmm. Uh, is this the same in your the private hospital no, also? In the private hospital, I'm working in the physiotherapy in institute. Mm -hmm. So it's only with physiotherapists, you know, uh, athletes. Athletes, you know, yes. Yeah. Uh, so like sports teams or individual athletes, they the have Olympics. a deal with the and the Olympic Olympics, athletes, yes. yeah. And also they try to invade, you know, invade the proper world, you know, yeah, to no. enter the other division. Like other clinics to yeah, get integrated in language. Yes, yeah. fatality, uh, oncologist also. You know. And is there interest from the patients or from the hospital administration, you would say, from the doctors, let's say? Both. Both, that's Both. the way to go. Right. Mm -hmm. Not every doctor, but, uh, oh, you know, but yeah, yeah, but they're also open-minded for it. Yeah. So, all right, you know, so fantastic news. And let me ask you, as an as an Israeli reflexologist, where do you see it going, or what would you like to see? How would you like to see reflexology advance? Because I'm sure for many of our viewers, friends on the Facebook page, yes. some might be jealous, you know, in a sense, meaning that, wow, they're in hospitals, they're doing this. Where do you want to go from here? What do you think for the future of mm, reflexology? It's a good, it's a good one. Mm. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> I think uh, for first, we need to to join hands all over the world, you know, to do like we are doing, you know, go... The reflexologists yes. have a strong community amongst yes. ourselves, yes. correct, yes. I yes. agree with yes. that. Yeah. Also, because in Israel they are starting new communities by Facebook and this network so we can connect. So in know. social media it helps. Yes. Yeah. It helps. Yes. It helps. Yes. And always learning, you know, learn and learn, you know, be practice about fields that you have, you know, you want to be better. No, we Continuing are education. Yes. Yeah. Have you been involved in research? Uh, not yet. Not, not yet. Not yet. But but it will, yeah, it will happen. I it feel will. that you want it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. I hope you enjoyed this spontaneous and mini conversation we had. I enjoyed three days with you. And it was yeah. great. And would you like to greet people in your native language? Oh. Bye from me. <laughs> All right, so nice to have you, Nias. Bye, Fabrilito. Shalom. All right, wishing you the best.